humility of the Prophet. The caravan had been moving for hours and the signs of exhaustion were quite apparent among the riders. Oh, we are tired now. I don't know. I don't know why water can't be found anywhere here. If we find any water, we should make preparations for offering prayers immediately. Oh, look there, water. Water has been found. So let's go there as quickly as possible. Come on. Put down your load. We shall sojourn for a while. Look there. How eagerly the Prophet is approaching the water. But what happened? The Prophet has returned to his camel. Does he think this place is unsuitable for stopping and wants to give the order to proceed? One of the men said, I don't know. What should we do now? We should wait for the command of the Prophet. The Holy Prophet took the shackles off the camel from the pannier and tied them to the knees of the animal and then started proceeding toward the water again. O oh, Prophet of God, why didn't you order us to do it for you? Yes, it would have been a great honor to do this service for which we were always ready. And the Holy Prophet answered, Never ask for help from others in doing what you must do yourself, and don't ever rely on them even if it is something small like a piece of stick for brushing teeth.